wanna love ya Every day and every night uh, My name is Jason Marshall, I'm uh, born in North Vancouver I play uh, for the Capilanos and my CRC team is uh, the Bears It's like my long term goal for like three years ago was honestly make World Cup So I'm kind of met that goal to some extent on my way there but uh, on the field for the next couple of months would also to be fun to play in all the games in the World Cup and off the field I don't know I just really just uh, lead a successful life and that's either continuing with rugby after World Cup or if that doesn't happen try and find something else. Well, I think it, that I'm kind of like the dual sport guy, like kind of grew up with rugby and football. I would find like pauses in both. And then I think while I was growing up, like playing rugby, I, I liked the, the hitting factor, just the fact that I was playing quarterback in football and I really got to hit anybody. So like I think why originally it was more just the fact that I could just go hit guys and try and hurt them. But I hated it at first. And I wasn't. I don't know. I was. I wasn't loving rugby then. That's for sure. I totally thought that was. Uh, it, was it was really tough with the, especially with the ego, going from a position where I thought I was doing really well at. And I don't know. I don't know. Usually, in a rugby game, you compare yourself to against the guy across from me on the other team. And I thought in most games when I was playing, I don't know, back row or number eight, I was doing a pretty good job of competing against. Him. And then. All of a sudden, change the, the tight end. And, uh, excuse my language, but I was getting my ass handed to me. And it was, and it was uh, pretty demoralizing, but I don't know, over a couple of years of experience has kind of helped me a lot in growing and playing against guys and like, against like France and Georgia and stuff where they kind of learn the hard way, but those kind of games really helped me. And, and, well, I actually started my rugby career off at uh, Inside Center. Oh, I think I'd uh, probably choose inside. Just, just a lot of crash balls. Yeah. Yeah, not much speed, a lot of crash. You'll find me either in the gym or playing video games. I'd, I'd, I'd say that I'm the best at, uh, or I'm decent at Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2. Uh, I'd have to say uh, get the UMP 45 and go uh, with a silencer. Run around and go, go kill some guys. <laughs> um, obviously, thank my parents. Uh, they've done a lot for me over the last, well, since I was born, obviously, and they've kind of supported me in my decision making with uh, pursuing rugby after university. And so, yeah, I think they'd be, uh, I guess, my number one. And obviously, the coaches and stuff, and so, I don't know, giving me a chance, being like a. Oh, pretty new to the, the whole international stage like three years ago and they kind of, I guess, like Kieran had, uh, I guess saw the potential in me and gave me a, ch a shot and this has kind of paid off, so I thank Kieran as well. I feel like it went uh, Gandalf in that very first, uh, I, don't know, I forget what the, what the name of the first part of the trilogy is, but he gets up on that bridge and he's gets up in front of the monster and he has a staff here and he goes, You shall not pass! Praise God. <laughs>